In this video, I will discuss the security services offered by Security Information and Event Management or SIEM solutions. So these services include log centralization, log normalization and alerts. So uh, all the endpoints, servers, workstations, network devices, applications, cloud services and security tools generates local log and this log data is overwhelming uh, to find or search any meaningful information in a manual uh, manner. Therefore, uh, we use a SIEM solution and all uh, these devices are configured to forward a copy of their local log to this central repository of SIEM solution. And in certain system, uh, this feature is not supported. Therefore, uh, you may have to install a software agent which uh, collects the local log on that system and then forward this log to SIEM solution. And here at uh, Security Information and Event Management System, the integrity is protected of this log data uh, since the local uh, system admin or network admin cannot delete uh, the log data which is centrally stored on SIEM solution because he does not have uh, the access uh, to that SIEM solution and this SIEM solution is managed and administrated by a security administrator which is a separate role. However, a local administrator uh, can reconfigure his respective asset to stop forwarding its local log copy to SIEM solution. Now in log uh, normalization uh, the different uh, devices uses different formats of their log and these all uh, formats are converted into a standard format. For example, some uh, systems would be using user ID and other would be using the user uh, name for same type of information. So all these uh, similar types of informations are uh, converted into a standard format and standard labeling is applied which facilitate a SIEM solution to perform uh, searches and to perform correlation of log data across different log sources that is different endpoints. Now in correlation and analysis uh, SIEM builds a relationship of, a, of an offensive activity uh, based upon the log data which is received from different log sources. So here at SIEM solution, uh, the signature of an abnormal, abnormal activity across different log sources uh, is developed. And furthermore, uh, the enrichment can also be used uh, to add additional context uh, from different external intelligence ap application or maybe the cloud application or cyber threat intelligence platform. So these all external applications provide a context of an abnormal activity to SIEM solution. So this is, uh, this, these all informations are converted into an actionable intelligence by a SIEM solution. Now the final uh, service is the alerting. So in correlation and analysis, we will build different uh, correlation uh, rules. And once these rules gets triggered uh, due to any offense, then these offense are uh, made available or uh, these offense are uh, seen by the security administrator of a theme solution on the console of theme. 
So it is a kind of automated continuous monitoring by a SIEM solution. Furthermore, certain uh, SIEM also offers the ability to investigate and to initiate the incident response against these alerts. So maybe there would be a ticketing mechanism and then tracking of these investigation efforts. For example, what all analysts are working on a particular alert, what all incident response steps are being taken, and what all artifacts are being uh, collected related to an offense. However, uh, mostly this uh, service uh, is a part of separate solution, for example, security orchestration, automation and response or SOAR platform. This was all. Thank you.